Hello everybody, it's Lucas Macintosh here and I'm back with some more Perfect Dark for the Nintendo 64. Thank you so much for taking the time to check out one of my retro Let's Play videos, I really appreciate it. If you are indeed enjoying my content and like to see more, why not hit that subscribe button because what it means for you lovely people is you will be instantly subscribed to my channel and notified every time I upload a new video and I've got new content coming each and every single week. Okay, so once again uh, it is Secret Agent Mode and I'm attempting to do the next level. I just got about got through Chicago by the skin of my teeth that was a very hard mission to do they added in an extra objective in which um, Joanna had to set up her own um, escape route uh, so that in the next level data dying can blow through so it's a nice sort of continuity thing they got going on now we're inside the G5 building and there's probably like something else I need to do uh, this mission can be very difficult not less because I think you can fail the objectives if the guards are alerted and they set the alarms off so you kind of need to get rid of the guards before they do that so this again might take me a few tries but I think I'm up to the challenge okay G5 building reconnaissance special agent here we go I need to deactivate the laser grid systems holograph the meeting conspirators retrieve Dr. Carl back up from safe and exit building oh, on the surface it doesn't seem too difficult um, I don't think I'll have any problem deactivating the laser grid systems because I'm sure that in agent mode I did find those switches and I kind of did that so it'll be interesting. Okay I think there's like a brief cutscene coming up I will see you after that where we will crack on with the mission. Alright, it's game time. Now, these guards have got cloaking devices, making them very difficult to shoot. Hang on, anyone else? Okay, that was actually pretty cool. So yeah, um, the guards are actually going to shoot you a lot more accurately um, on Secret Agent mode and also Perfect Agent as well. I don't know if I'm ever going to get to Perfect Agent, but I'm going to do my best. I'm just going to take little small steps towards my goal because, to be honest, my main goal in life or in gaming was just to get through GoldenEye and just to do it on every setting, which I've now accomplished. And now, Perfect Dark is the next one. I actually find this a really fun game and less frustrating than GoldenEye. It just seems a lot fairer, I think. Okay, let me just press this switch. Ah, so that switch deactivates a laser grid. Right, I think I understand. So I need to press all those switches that I see. Right, we're in this other sort of little area now and as soon as I go over here more guards are going to appear come on where are you there you go got you Anyone else? Oh, no, yeah. Got ya. Oh, this is a real painful level at times as well. Because you can kind of get shot up right away at the beginning and it's not fun. Okay, this bit sucks. Because as soon as I go through the door, it's like the guards get alerted and I could fail the mission. It's not kind of what I want to do, so I'm going to see if I can do this. No way oh, don't want to press that. There we go. Any more? Any more for any more? 
Ah. There you go. There you go, objective one completed. Not bad. So now I've done that, I've got to think about what I need to do next. I, n I need to um, holograph the meeting, don't I? So I'll need to get rid of any guards I see on the ground floor. There we go. So if I get rid of the guards below, then I should be alright. And I've just messed stuff that up. I don't think there's anywhere else I can go though. I ain't gone the stairs. I need to get rid of the guards because I don't want them setting the alarms off. There you go. Got ya. Crap. Got ya. There we are, power that down. I don't know whether that's going to make a difference, but it's cool that I've done that anyway. It's not one of my objectives, but the main thing is just to get rid of the guards because, again, they are a pain in the glass, trust me. You go you go to enter a room, they set the alarms off, and you fail. It's really unfair, but not as unfair as Goldeneye, I don't think. At least they give you a chance to redeem yourself in this game most of the time. So it's just about knowing uh, and what you need to do at the right times I suppose all right now I need to go across this walkway and then try and get rid of some guards if I can oh, if I can just get Joanna to duck down I could get, there we are this is that I need to peek very carefully Bound to be guards here somewhere. There's one. There you go. Okay. Nice. Now we're on the other side now. So what that means is now open this door but I don't want to go through it because it'll lock so that door's locked so I think I've cleared the way now I think I'll be all right possibly I don't know there's more stairs here this is where I've already been that's all right okay cool I think we're good to go again you've got to make sure that that way is clear and you're probably wondering why I'm going back here well you, to holograph the meeting you need to be on top on here and I need to get the cam spy in to do it so I need to go all the way back up again and then all the way around don't worry I'm not dropping down because I need to that's where we need that's the meeting so I need to use the cam spy let's get the cam spy out okay send the cam spy in we've recovered the sapient from Carrington and altered its programming it no longer has a personality, so there will be no further incidents. This will reduce its efficiency. My team will have to take it to the core themselves. This will endanger them. You should have anticipated that the Sapient might develop a troublesome moral code. No one could have predicted that, and I resent being singled out for blame. What about him? <laughs> President's turned down the request for the loan of the Pelagic 2. Could it be you overestimated your influence over him? No. Perhaps I underestimated his resolve. We have a contingency plan ready to go, and we will move as soon as the presidential honorage arrives at the airbase. All I need from the president is a tissue sample. Assume you don't get any interference. If Carrington has pieced together enough of this, he will have called for reinforcements. There will be no outside help from Mr. Carrington. The technology you gave us is installed in Nevada and fully operational. We can intercept any craft they use. Then the devices we gave you are working correctly. 
good, because we believe anything which does not work correctly should be destroyed. Consider that as you follow your backup plans. Alright, so, with that being done, let me just check the objectives. I need to retrieve Dr. Cow's backup from the safe and exit the building, so I can't quite remember where that is, but I'm going to have to find it. I have to look around and look very carefully. I don't think it's in here. I've already been here. I've got to just have a look around. It's not down there, so we've ruled that out. I said this can be really awkward because there's often different routes and I've got to find where they are. I need to work out where they are and where the hell I'm going right. I don't think it's that way. I should be able to actually, I think I know where to go now. Oh that door's locked, oh for God's sake. Right, yeah I've, I've figured it out. I need to go back up here. I need to go back this way through the locked door. I think the door should now be unlocked maybe. Maybe that's it. So yeah, it's like kind of a guessing game. And trying to exit can be quite confusing because I tend to get all flustered when there's like so many guards on screen at one time at the safe bit. So that's going to be fairly challenging. That door's locked. Okay, fair enough. Ah, it'll be this door. Right, I got it. Okay, going up. Got him. There we go. Oh, this could all go Pete Tong at any minute. The safe's heavily encrypted. The decoder's gonna take a little longer. Right, okay, here we go. Wish me luck, guys. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to take him out like this. I'm going to go to the side because then they'll try and shoot me forwards. I've got 40 odd seconds to deal with them though. Guys, just gotta keep my cool. Come on, I'll take that. Thank you. Got it. All right, I need to get in that safe quickly. All right, go. Okay, now I need to get out of here. Right, okay. Right, is it this way? I think it is. Yeah, this is it. We're getting out of here, guys. I don't care what it takes. Alright, good. That's not it. The other door. I need to find the other door. There's like another. Hang on a minute. Remote mine. Got it. Hang on. Okay. I don't know how to get out. How the hell do I get out of here? If this isn't it, then where is it? It'll be the lower door, then, surely. Where is it? This is ridiculous. Come on. I don't I don't know how to get out of here. There's no way out. 
Honestly, there is no way out. I don't know where I'm going. I need to figure this out. This is stupid. I don't know how to get out of here. Okay. I'll try again. There's got to be a way. I don't understand why why I'm not able to, to leave. Right. Okay. I can't, I can't, I can't get out. I don't know how to get out, guys. Oh, shit. I've got no ammunition now. I don't get it. Where do I go? This is stupid. Like, how the hell am I supposed to get out of it? I set everything up so she'd be able to leave. But she's just not leaving. So I don't know where I'm going. Okay. So it'd be one of these, surely. Sorry guys, I'm just extremely frustrated at the moment because I set it up so she, she could leave on the last level. So she's not doing it. I don't get why I can't leave. Unless it's this way, unless it's a different route. Maybe I've just, because I think I, I've done things a little bit differently. In, the, in agent mode, they actually help you. In this mode, they don't, so. Ah, oh, I think I know. I think I know what to do. Hang on. I'm going to try and get out of here now. Come on. Oh, that does a lot of shit. Okay, good. It'll be this one then, won't it, surely? Yeah, it'll be this one. And I think it might be this way. It's got to be, because there's nowhere else I can go. Let's try going this way. Come on. Okay, I don't know where I'm going then. Unless I need... I don't get it. Exit building. How do I exit the building? 